I think uh, nowhere uh, is safe in the Gaza Strip. I think uh, people have learned it the hard way. And this is also true for humanitarian workers. Many humanitarian workers uh, were killed, whether in the line of duty or living in their houses. It is very unfortunate uh, what we were seeing over the past weeks, uh, hospitals becoming uh, battlegrounds, uh, uh, fighting happening inside and around hospitals. And this is why we keep and we will keep on repeating those obligations to parties to the conflict that hospitals should be preserved, should not be used in any way or another uh, in, in, the, in the framework of military operations and should be protected. That actually um, those projects can help. Warnings and asking civilians to uh, evacuate is something that a party to a conflict can do, of course, provided that uh, civilians have a plan B or have options. Fact of the matter, and uh, with now 50 days in the fighting, uh, we know that uh, civilians in the Gaza Strip uh, have run out of options. And supporting uh, water authorities to increase the capacity. And we offered our role uh, of neutral intermediary to facilitate any negotiated uh, release of hostages. So this offer still stands uh, and we hope that uh, parties will reach uh, more agreements uh, to free hostages on one side and Palestine detainees on the other.